Okay guys, today we'll deal with the error AWS snap something went wrong while displaying this web page and it is displaying the error code something like it's a crash pad handle or did not respond so number of solution in this tutorial one the either solution will help you I guess in case you do not get help by either of the solution you can search for the other solution across the web so I have come up with some of the solutions the first solution you're gonna try is so on the top you're gonna see this refresh icon in Chrome just hit the refresh icon and problem should be gone the next solution you can try you're gonna see this three dot line just hit the three dot line and then you're gonna click on history here you're gonna see history just click on history this will open the history page in your browser at the bottom you're gonna see here clear browser data so this should be on the left hand side at the bottom click on it on the top you'll have a couple of options to choose basic and advanced you're gonna choose advanced from the drop down you're gonna choose all time now you're gonna check all the box so you can check all the box so if you feel like some of the necessary item like password and other sign in data if you do not want to delete those if it's important for you so lots of important data you're gonna uncheck that box if you feel like it is really very necessary for you and you do not want to delete it from the browser so you can uncheck this box otherwise just check the box this is most necessary you're gonna check the first of that is uh, browsing history download history cookies and other site and one more thing is kg image and files minimum you're gonna check this four box about other boxes that are important for you like password and other you do not want to delete just uncheck those box you must check this four field and then click on clear data you can see here you have clear data just hit this so I'm just hitting this now so as soon as you hit that button it will clear all your history case and cookies now you're gonna retry opening your browser it should be working fine otherwise proceed to the third solution in third step again click on three dot line and then after you're gonna click on settings so as soon as you click on settings on the left hand side you're gonna see reset settings just click on that and then after come to the write up page on the write up page you're gonna see reset settings with the button sorry not with the button but with the arrow icon just click on it as soon as you click on it you're gonna see this option so what it does is it resets all chrome settings disable the extension delete all the cookies and temporary data of the sites as soon as you click on reset settings it will do all the reset works now after clicking on this button again come back and relaunch the chrome and then after you're gonna check it the issue should be gone still the issue exists problem not fixed proceed to the fourth solution so the fourth solution is here it is a chrome you can see it's a shortcut icon of a chrome browser give a right click on it and then click on properties as soon as you open the properties you're going to see this box now here on the top here you have a target just go you can see all the leave it as it is just at last you can use your arrow icon in the keyboard once you take the cursor at last just hit one space 
after hitting the one space you're going to copy the commands let me show you the commands here is the commands even i have left it in the video description just copy this command sorry it is not in the video description it is in the comment section it's a pinned post in the comment section you will get this over there just copy it otherwise you can just type it as it is and paste it over here now once you have done that add come down let me show you the properties just take this box a little bit up and here have option to apply so you just have to click on apply do not forget to apply it now you will go to the compatibility now you can see run the compatibility here you have the sorry i did not show you uh, i was in the general sorry in the shortcut now we will go to compatibility here you can see it's a compatibility in compatibility here you have a option compatibility mode so you you're going to check that if it is not checked and here you have a number of options so you're going to choose the highest one if it is a windows 7 vista you're going to choose the highest one whatever is the highest if it is windows 10 and you are using windows 10 if you have option for the windows 10 you're going to choose that one if you have option for the windows 11 you're going to choose that one currently the highest is windows 8 so you're going to choose that one again come down don't forget to apply and then click on ok now come back and check it it should be working your browser should work fine AWS snap error should go away so this was the first solution now no more issue AWS snap error should go away so there are some other solutions that you can try go to search so these all are the few minor steps that you can try it might fix i can't guarantee you so if all the first four solutions did not help you you can try these few steps too uh, go to the source and you're gonna type update and then you're gonna see over here check for the updates and you're gonna update your pc and when you click on it it will take you to the update page you can just download and check for the updates download and install the updates if necessary you can restart your pc so sometimes what you can do is sometimes you can use uh, new you can do click on uh, it's a new incognito mode a new incognito window and this will open this incognito window and you can use this one so sometimes you can use this uh, in a incognito mode if sometimes it is really very necessary and you do not want to try those steps and if you do not want to close the Chrome browser, if it is really very necessary, uh, you are using some other tabs that cannot be closed right now at this moment, it is really very important for you, you can use this new tab. So I can guarantee to help, but this solution also helps sometimes. This tab has the error, you can just click on plus button and you can use the new tab and try to uh, search for the stuff or open the same URL again. So I can guarantee for this, this solution, uh, but sometime it to help. Sometime uh, internet connection becomes the problems, you can check for your internet connections. You can see as the internet connections, uh, make sure it is uh, working fine, so your internet connection is connected and it's really working fine. So sometime this uh, extension will cause the problems. So lots of extension if you are using in a browser, try to disable some of the untrusted and unwanted extension and you can just try using the browser. So all these were the different other minor solutions that you could try. So the couple of more minor solutions that you can try is you can just uh, restart your PC and give a one try. And sometime you can just uh, update your Chrome, download the latest version of Chrome from the internet and you can just install the latest version of chrome if you are using the older version so all these were the very best solution that you could try i hope it uh, helped you guys and be sure to share this video like subscribe and comment i'll catch you in the next tutorial with another great stuff